last year in Iadja. But as you know, I'm going to introduce myself to you lads that don't know me, but I'm sure most of you do. Harry Powell, ex football league referee, not because I've got Man United, Wolves, and Villa. In August, I was 75 years of age. <coughs> That's before some of you were born. I must be coming to the end. But I've always done this because I talk to professional players, so please take note because I won't repeat it when I get out there. Now, for you lads that have heard it before, you know what's coming. But for you lads that haven't, please, please take note. But if I can't shut you up, the Birmingham County FA will. Now, the takings of any free kick have got to award on and around the penalty area. I'm not a referee that's going to pace out the 10 yards. I shall stand on the ball, and I want you off the ball quickly all the way around. But if you take a free kick from midfield, from the correct place, the correct place, that's okay with me, but on and around the penalty area, please, please wait for the whistle. Two, Swahili, Chinese, Japanese, Russian, and the black country, I know a lot. The four letter words, they haven't changed. They don't get calling me anything, all them. And if you do, you're in trouble. But you're men, and I'm going to treat you as men, not boys. You call it industrial language in the black country. You probably will be inclined to swear amongst yourselves. Now let me get this straight. Tone it down. Because my wife's here this morning, and if she hears any bad language, I'm not going to get no dinner. Let's get that straight. Mr. Manager, trainer, or skipper, if I'm an injured or player, I want that player removed from the line as quickly as possible. With every respect, you're more qualified than me, and if you need time, you'll have it. Yes? As you know, 54 years in refereeing in the Kidderminster League, and I made the Football League list. I'm the worst referee that you're ever going to have. And I'm going to tell you why. I don't allow players to mouth off at me and tell me what to do and what to give. What I've known of you black country lads, you've always let your feet do the talking and not your mouth. Anybody that mouths off to me this morning, I'm going to drop on you like a ton of bricks. And there's three teams out there this morning lads, the yelling here and your opponents out there. And you know I'm going to win. If you can come in second, I don't mind. Any questions?